Okay. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna climb this mountain, rotate around to Bonoro Stand, and then we're gonna check out the Pillars of Livia. Then, how do I have a monster marked here? I've never been there. That's weird. We're gonna check that out. Probably a Lionel or a Hinox. I don't know what, but we're gonna check that out. We're gonna check this out. We're just gonna like do a lot of walking around probably and stuff. Maybe we'll check out in the middle of Hyrule Field and stuff before we check out Hyrule Castle. So we just have a lot of stuff to do before I um either finish side questing or um bust open the guide to do more side questing. And then um and then I uh Excuse me, um... I have so many weapons now. What am I gonna do? I have so many weapons, I don't know what to do with them. Is that a crossy spot over there? Yes, I got it already. So I make sure, you know, normally I wouldn't give two hoots if I already found all the cross seeds or a third of them, but if I see it and I didn't do it, I'm going to do it. Yep. Sorry, Link, please don't tumble down the hill. I'm sorry, Link, please don't tumble down the hill. Look, see, you got a piece of amber for your troubles. Alright, where are we? Alright, we're going to go just straight north now. Because we've checked out everywhere else, sir. Uh... Got some rocks over here. Where are these supposed to go? Anywhere in specific, down there. Let's push these down. Alright, um, I found a Kuroxy spot there apparently, but I've never been there. No, that's the one I just did. Okay, I must say, like, how did I do that? <laughs> how can I find a Kuroxy spot if I've never been down there? Alright, we don't have to go down there, though. This is the tumbling rock. 
All right, let's uh cross these mountains. Doesn't look like there's much of anything over here. Do I see a goblin camp? That's a change of pace. That's a lot of fish, too. And grab some of the fish. went down. I don't think I've been down here though. I haven't been to Lexalia, so maybe I'll check it out. Link, could you attack the freaking uh, Octa Rock that's like right in front of you? Fortunately, I got rid of my. Unfortunately, I got rid of my. Uh, what should we call it? Um, that's where that's where a uh, wizard rope is. Yep, I dealt with that wizard before. That might be the first time I saw a wizard. Robe. Yeah, I think so, actually. This is kind of near. Yeah, this is, yeah, this is exactly near there. I think. That might that be that might be the very first wizard I ran into. Over there. I didn't exactly know what it was while I was looking at, but. Let's check out, let's check out like Celia. Yeah, basically right now, I'm just checking out everywhere I haven't been yet for some reason. Because as much as I feel like I've been all over the map, there's still areas I just haven't been to yet. So you might as well check them all out.
fucking hate Aqua Rocks in this game. Alright, so what's up with this metal box? I literally can't believe that I learned that you can fucking freeze mud, pools of deep mud and shit. I did not know that at all, and then I learned it fucking 95% through the game and shit. If that's the same case in Breath of the Wild 2, then Breath of the Wild 2 will be also just as swimmingly. Will we'll go very much swimmingly, in my opinion. Took me a while to get here, but I didn't. I know there's a lot of those spots around the fucking world, but I just didn't know that's what you do to them, so now I just not I'm never gonna be able to do that. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Looks like so there's a way we can get up there from here. When I was standing on was the last one I made, or the first one I made, rather. Like, I'm pretty sure there's another one right over there. The question is, am I going to go all the way over there to do that right now? And now that I'm over here. I could, it's not too far from where I am. You're a traveler that I don't fuck with. Did you? Did you? Honestly, I don't fuck with you, but you look like you just, you, you did something more than just, like, negate the effect of my fucking fire, bro. I heard the weather's gonna be nice tomorrow. Too bad I ain't allowed to enjoy it. For Master Kona! Let's get a lunch money. Ugh. 
It's both a blessing and a curse that you can't hurt all NPCs. Because sometimes they deserve it. Preemptively. Fucking serious? I just fucking killed your fucking friend. You're so annoying. So, now where was I? Let's go back to the Pillars of Levio. Might as well take the bow. Because we have the storage for it now. Hmm? Yeah? Darn it. I saw a bladed beetle, rhino beetle, and I didn't get it. You head toward Hatemo Village, just cross the bridge and head to the east. I saw a few things that picked up our travels. Ooh. What do you got? <sighs> Some beetles. Ah. Ah. Yeah, stamina items. It's not Ooh. bad. Rupees over rubies. Yeah. Have you got some experience handling dangerous items like bombs? There's a ton of high quality ore around here that bombs can be can be used to mine it quickly. Plus, there are, there will be a cool explosion. Just don't stick bombs off near me, okay? Yes, yes, I know. You told me that over 300 episodes ago. All right. Um. I love he says his head across his village and then go west like fucking Hatino village is like just. Over the fucking hill, like, dude, Hatuna Village is a while from here. <laughs> and it's a lot of monsters along the way, including some guardians, too. If you're going to Hatuna Village, cross the bridge and go west. It's like, okay. Like, it's not fucking clear across the fucking country. Alright, let's find this hill. See what we got going on up here. I saw a shooting star just now. Where did it land? Where did it go? Where did it land? Cotton Eye Joe. Is it all the way over there? What is- yeah, I think so. God damn. Oh, it's super fucking far.
let's check out what is around the area a little fast, and then we'll start climbing, I guess. Try to remember there's a shooting star over there that landed somewhere, and I'll try to get to, I guess, but... We will have to see. Do I have a, um... A fin roll scale? I wonder what happens if I mix that in a, um... In a shooting star together. They say cooking is a waste, but I don't really know what you can make out of it that wouldn't be just dubious food, probably. I found Hetsu in the very beginning. Yeah, I think so, actually. Whoa, fucking Blood Moon. Really? Cringe. I'm pretty sure that's that's the goblin camp down there where I met Hetsu the, in the very beginning of this let's play. Don't need to go over there. something to be careful about. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Alright, there's a shooting star. Okay. Um. Don't really know what all to find in this area, but let's uh, give everything a look at Gander. Just was. Oh, okay. So one of these clips I haven't checked out yet, so I guess I check out this one first. It's not too far out of the way, so sure, fuck it, why not? fell all the way down. Hey everybody, look! There's a Yiga clan guy over here, Shiku Village. Let's all put him on a freaking on a stick and hang him. <laughs> For betraying the Hyrule and Royal family. Yeah, you're burning to death. It's like, fuck! He puts up fire arrows? I only later have fucking dumbass normal arrows. I was like, yeah. You're lucky you disappeared because they would have turned you into the Kakariko royal government. They would have freaking castrated you for betraying the royal family and signing with Ganon, of all people. Try to attack me right outside of Kakariko village. It's fucking ballsy. That's what it is. Yep. 
nothing up here, not even a cross seed on this tall ass mount I've never been on before. That's crazy. Alright, um, there's another one over there that I could check out. That's why I'm over here on the side of the of the ship. I believe it's this one right here. I believe so. Nothing up here. Ah, oh, man. Excuse me. I really want to like listen to reviews of this game, and especially retrospectives, and see what people think about it. Honestly, like, I love it. It's a great, awesome game. I just feel like there's a lot of nothingness in between. Um. The parts where there is actually stuff. That's my only gripe with it. Aside from that, you guys already know I want more monsters, more events, bigger goblin camps, shit like that. Nice. Well, thank you. I'm glad one of these moms has something. Proxy guys. Imagine if we're this far in the game, we only found 80 Korok seeds. That would be embarrassing. My like, dude, are, are you even looking? What are you doing? Wow, two crosses so incredibly close to each other. Alright, so we got these two pillars and then that's the last one over here. Um
starting down there? Have I been down there before? Yes, I have. Okay. Well, we do have to check out the Sahara. That's a, it's a Hazra Slope. As well as Lantern Lake. So I guess we can do all that right now. Um, there's nothing really up here. So, I guess we could do that. Let's find a guardian, I suppose. That sounds like fun. Then we could check out what? Sahara Slope. So yeah, we have it for some reason. And then Lantern Lake. And then we can kind of check out everything between here. And the Millennial Sandbar. But then we have to go back to Lenny Heights. Completely forgot about that, but we'll be there. We'll get there. So, um, Naval Ridge, I think, hold on, okay, there might be another Guardian up here, because I might have seen it, and then not attacked it or fought it, because I know there might be a stone house around here somewhere, let's check out these areas real fast, and then we'll, uh, then we'll go back and check. Pretty sure there's stone towels around here. I think there's a guardian down there, I think. There's another guardian right over here. Pairing it or I, okay, I'm definitely not. I didn't even want to use all of my Bruce protections. I kind of want. I was trying to parry it, but the, the parry um, the parry window is a little slimmer now. All right, so there's the guardian up here, which I think we either knew already or we didn't. Parry window is a lot slimmer when you have a fucking drogue protection because it's kind of automatic parry, except, uh. I don't know. It's good. It's not bad. So let's see what's up here. Then we'll, uh. call it for this video. Got a gobble camp. Have I been up here before? I have. Okay. Oh. Well, uh, we could either deal with them or we can loop back around, but I think we'll just loop back around. Loop back around, see what else we can find around here. 